this is a very different kind of background and we had a little clothing rack of some pieces that I picked up for this fall. So as you can tell, this is going to be a fall fashion haul and I just wanted to share with you guys some of the favorite pieces I picked up and how to style them in different ways. So we don't have that many pieces here, but I'm going to show you how I can style them with jeans or a skirt or different ways. So before I start, if you aren't already, please subscribe to my channel at Glow with Ava. Follow me on Instagram at Glow with Ava as well, where I share daily outfits and stuff. And also hit that subscribe and let's begin. Just like a star across my sky, just like an angel off the page, you have appeared to my with showing you guys this current outfit. So I think this is a year where different colors come up but also different styles. So shorts are back in. And I think growing up in high school, I went through a really big short phase where I would pair shorts and stockings and long boots with every outfit that I was wearing to the point where I got my mom to even hand make me some shorts out there. But I haven't worn shorts in a while, but then I went to Cezanne and they had all these really, really nice like suede corduroy shorts and I fell in love with these olive shorts. They're so pretty, very easy. I love the high button, the high rise thing and you can pair it with a knit top like this. This is from Aritzia um, or even like a silky top. There's so many wearers to wear this. So maybe you guys can see it better when I'm walking down the stairs like this but these shorts are so comfy. And I'm wearing the size extra small, but you can wear them to your work. It's very classy. It's very formal, professional, and all of that, depending on how you style with it. Because you can wear a blazer on top, a long blazer, so that you can't even see that you're wearing shorts. So here is a blazer jacket from Allison Olivia. I've had this for like three years now. But it's so perfect to wear to your workplace, just like that. And it kind of hides your shorts and you can wear whatever you need and it's a really really nice perfect outfit and i love wearing it with like high boots like these these are from Stuart weitzman there are plenty of other um, boot options out there but this is my, one of my favorite ways to style them and i had to show it to you first because i've been wearing it literally non-stop the next piece i want to show you guys is another piece from Cezanne, and this is a nice little white cardigan. It is the coziest thing in the world and I actually like pairing this with these shorts as well. It goes really well together and it, they have this in white and black as well. I wanted to get the black but the black was sold out too but this is in size extra small and if you can just wear it like this. You can wear it at home or outside. Surprisingly these have like little holes in here but still it is so 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 soft and warm. So I like pairing this with like belts and I actually had to purchase a belt with this from Cezanne as well. So this is the belt that came with it. I got it in a size bigger so I had to take it to a store to shorten it for me. But after I shortened it, it is perfect. It's got a really, really, really pretty color and it pairs perfectly with this outfit as you can see. So this top is like the perfect top to wear with a belt and also I haven't worn a belt with any kind of sweater in such a long time. This feels like another high school thing trend that I was into but I'm so happy to have this back in my life. And right now, I you can't even tell that I'm wearing shorts. I'm just wearing my high boots with stockings and this is just like the perfect outfit for the workplace or you know like a casual day as well. Alright so I changed into a different skirt that kind of matches this um, belt a little more. So I can move my sweater like this and then have the skirt show a little more instead of kind of wrapping the whole thing around. So that's the beauty of the sweater where you can wear it kind of like completely wrapped up or show a little bit more color and um, you can kind of get creative with what you want to wear inside of that. So um, this skirt is this leather skirt from Verified and it is so gorgeous. It's like a really nice camel mustardy color that I've been dying to get um, for the fall. So yeah, I paired it in the same way with these boots and stockings and it's the perfect combination. Alright, so the next top I'm going to be wearing is this beautiful top from Lovers and Friends. It's a little more revealing than the other tops I usually wear but I just love this print so much that I couldn't resist. And you can wear like a bra or like stickers underneath this but absolutely no bra because you just want to accentuate this neckline which is so, so beautiful. I'd rather wear it with like a nice like slim fitting black jeans. Um, than this outfit. 
All right, I'm just here to give you guys a better idea of what this top would look like. I'm too lazy to get out of these tights because I wanted to keep my tights on for this entire video, honestly. But imagine like I'm wearing black leggings or black jeans with this outfit and it's so much better because it really gives you the accentuated top line and this flow just continues on with a skinny bottom right here. And another way you can honestly wear this is the black jeans you can wear with like a black skirt like this. So I have this leather skirt from Zara and it is really nice um, material and it pairs well with the black polka dots on here. But still, I still think the best look is to wear a black jeans or black leggings with this um, flowier top. So, but still, I still really like this black Zara skirt. So I'm going to wear another top with this and I'll show you how it looks. So here's another lovely outfit that I'm loving with the Zara skirt. And this is another top from Cezanne. It's like this nice, really silky top in size extra small. And I love this color, first of all. And then the little black polka dots. It's like the perfect size of black polka dots, if you know what I mean. And this top can easily be paired with like black jeans or jean, normal jeans, denim jeans, but also with like a black leather skirt like this. And the fact that the bottom of this has these like flurry things that makes it um, give like a little accent to the kind of more plain top that we have going on. And I have these like black patent booties going on with this whole outfit. So, so it's like a nice contrast of different kinds of patterns and textures that's going on with this entire outfit. And I also think this polka dot top pairs really well with the cocky Cezanne shorts I showed you guys earlier. The golden buttons right here really pair well with this overall silk top. So this, um, I think this brown and cocky color combination also goes really well. So this is one of my favorite tops of this fall. And since we're already wearing some leather, you can pair this with another leather jacket like this and it gives you a really sexy look. Perfect for like a date night out, Friday night out and this is a whole, you know, leather look. And yeah, I feel so powerful when I'm wearing this leather on leather, you know? All right, next we have our black turtleneck and black turtleneck can honestly be paired with any of the other bottoms I showed you guys earlier. But I think especially with this little skirt, it goes really well because with this skirt, this is a skirt from Lovers and Friends from Revolve. You need a really tight top like a bodysuit or a turtleneck that makes you feel like you're not wearing anything. You want to accentuate the waistline, especially because you have this really pretty like waistline details as well as a slight sit that goes down with um, buttons. So I feel like this kind of like trend with the little waistline, I've seen a lot of pants with this as well as skirts. So I've never tried one of these styles. So I want to try it out for this fall. So this is a pattern that I wasn't really sure of in the beginning, but I actually ended up loving, you know, this whole outfit with the all black with this accentuated bottom skirt goes really well. And as I said, these shorts would go really well with it as well. These shorts literally go with any top that I own, with any kind of sweater, turtleneck, any color combination. It's funny because it's a cocky olive color, which you would think it doesn't pair well, but it really, really fits perfectly into my wardrobe. So I have to say, this is probably one of my favorite pieces. All right, now we're keeping the black turtleneck, but completely changed an outfit, and it's this little dress from Zara that I'm absolutely in love with. So this is like an overall kind of dress, so you just have to wear this over a turtleneck. You can wear it with any kind of long sleeve, but I think wearing it with like a simple um, bodysuit or a turtleneck will be the best way to wear it. And I think with this pattern of black works the best as well. So the way this works was it was kind of confusing at first, but um, um, you got these like nice little pockets put your phone or things in and the waistline is a completely elastic stretching material so it doesn't so it doesn't even feel that tight and it's the comfiest thing because you just have to wear it like literally over your turtleneck i have it paired like this with um my patent booties once again um and then that's pretty much it but I figured that I could also wear it with a different kind of booties. Let me bring it. These are booties that I got from Anine Bing and they're like made with real fur and one of my favorite, favorite hair and bow prints ever. So look at this, these match really well too. So let me try these on and I'll show them to you. I mean, like just look at how cute these booties are with this whole outfit. I think they go better with these boots? I don't know, is it overkill to do both like these prints? Maybe it is better with the black boots right here. Tell me what you guys think. Let me know what shoes are better, 
these or that. So this is the next dress. It's like this cowl neck slip silk dress from Mazzara. And they made it so well. This is like an emeraldy green color that is perfect for like um, holiday season. And I actually wore this to a gala that I went to recently. So it's perfect for like a cocktail dress. You can dress it up or down with your jewelry and whatnot. But if you wear a turtleneck underneath it, that can also make it like a casual, really cute holiday outfit. Pair with like the same pair of um, boots and then wear a little coat over it. The coat that I'm going to be wearing is this new coat that I got from Mango this season and it's like got this really nice fur inside. It's the warmest thing ever, I swear to God. So, and then the outside is like this leather shape and once you wear it, like this makes an entire outfit. It's so, so chic and pretty, and it keeps me so warm. This coat is perfect for days when you're wearing like a really thin outfit because it will keep you so warm. And I don't know, I could literally just go out like this and make it a really nice outfit. Okay, and the last piece I wanna show you guys is actually this little cute top from Brandy. This is like one of the first tops that I purchased from Brandy actually. I was shopping with my little sister and she convinced me to go in the store and I walked out with this and it was one of the best buys because you can actually just wear it with jeans for like a weekend thing, but we can wear it with like a high rise skirt and it's like the perfect top because it can actually look really professional. I mean, from here and up, it's like a perfect LinkedIn picture. Even this is like such a chic outfit. I wish I had like more high rise pants, but these jeans also are these new jeans that I got from A Gold, and it's my first pair of A Gold jeans that I'm literally obsessed with. They're so stretchy. They're mid rise though, but even with that, they're so, so, so comfy. So paired it with another pair of these booties, and I don't know, this cotton is really actually good material, and I think I got it for. $35 or something like that. So pretty good price with these jeans and every top of that you can just pair with like your favorite cardigan like my Cezanne and call it a day. This is like a perfect fall uh, outfit. Thank you so much for watching my first fashion haul. This is really exciting to do and I really wish I could do more of these for the next season, winter or fall part two, whichever you want. But please let me know which was your favorite outfit. And if you guys want to see more videos like this, I would love to do more of these. Once again, please hit subscribe to my channel, follow me on Instagram. And until my next video, I will see you next.